Hello, I'm back for another episode and today we're in Town Square. Now, uh, for those who can't remember, Town Square is basically at the top of this tower here. Uh, which you can find through the side passageways. If you get lost, just uh, look at my first video and that'll show you the way. But anyway, let's go and have a look at Town Square. So, yes, more flying. Now, you might understand why I keep making the jabs that wish you could fly that well in the uh, missions. It is awful to fly, I'll tell you that. Now, nothing against the game or anything, but when they made this, the flight controls were probably the last thing they were thinking about. Something that I'm gladly told in Spyro 2 they did fix straight away. Right, that's two. So let's see who we got here. Niles. Welcome to Town Square, Spyro. Begin exploring by gliding to that area with the bulls. Use the L2 and R2 buttons to get a good look. Hello, I'm your toy guy for today. Please enjoy your trip. So L2 and R2, which I'll be doing already. But basically you aim, you jump, and you glide! Now bulls are a nightmare because you've got to run them, run them down, then you've got to flame them. Luckily you get the You get the gem. Ah, right. You get the gem through uh, hitting them. So ain't gonna worry if you um, don't kill them off. But if you don't kill them off, they sort themselves out and get back up on top. Now that was a special type of chest. I should have really said something about that before I automatically killed it. Basically, you have to flame it so the gem shoots up. Then jump on top of the box, grab the gem before it goes back in. But I see another one. I will probably, ho uh, hopefully, do a better job at showing you. Anyway, jump over here. Now the whole idea of this place is you jump from one platform to another platform to another platform and make the light! Yay! Make up for the one I lost earlier. But, down, and as you can see, just, it's all a big circular pattern. But who's this? Devlin! Duke Devlin for the ladies. Thanks, Spyro. Oh, I had the worst itch on the tip of my wing. Oh, did you know that you get your longest glides by pressing X at the very top of your jump? Thank you for repeating something someone said earlier, I think. Anyway. Uh, continue. Right. Now, if you save this guy from the bull, he will actually attack you. So. No, make sure you take him out. Now I can hear near 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 near, which obviously means another egg feed. My favourite. Now I'll go for him later, he's upstairs if you need to see him. But I've got other things to do. Goes up the steps, up and down, up and down. If you keep going up and down steps all day, you'll actually tone your muscles, you know that. Spyro doesn't care. Anyway. Can't do anything there, so this way it is. Now this is a bullathon. Wait, can it? The last guy there. Concussion. Wait. There he is. And he's just got to burn the ball. Okay, so we go here. Spyro. Did you see a man dressed in blue running around here? He's a thief, and he's stolen a dragon egg. You've got to track him down and, and get that egg. Run, run. <laughs> I'm getting a little winded. A little later, tell me now after I've already taken one out. But yep, yeah, as he mentioned, I've got to go and save the dragon egg. Just ran that night. Uh, from the evil little sh fellow. Yeah, I'm not actually this way at all. But yeah, alright, now the trick to get to him, if my memory serves me correct, is jump on here, fly around, take a bit of a leap of faith, which does pay off. Now as per normal, I'm not going to chase him straight off. 
I'm actually going to uh, slowly go around and collect all these mysteriously well placed gems and then that are really bad to play. Okay, flame. Or I could go flame on for all those fans of the uh, Fantastic Four. If they're only left. After that rather dubiously bad movie. Right. Now I don't know where he's gone to, and I'm not going to find him yet, because if you jump from hip here, you go over to here, which you get to that area that we saw earlier that we didn't get to. As I said, the whole place is basically jump from one place to another to another. Now, obviously, you've got to be very careful here, because if you fall off, you've got to start again. Which, believe me, is no fun. Okay, where's Senor Bull? Senor Bull! Oh, Thor! Talking about Avengers. Thank you for releasing me! As I've just realised, I wasn't talking about Avengers at all, so about the Fantastic Four, but yeah. So, take that out. Claim all this lot. Panoramic camera view. Okay, now these things you've got a basic turbine. So you flame it, it turns the turbine. If you keep flaming, it blows up, giving me my last 10 gems, I believe. Yes, 200 out of 200. I'm proud of myself. Now for that dragon egg. Let's see if I can do this. Ooh, it's very Okay, come on Nigel, you can do this, you are Spyro Incarnate, you are, I'm going to hell for this, um, okay, here we go, now where is he? That's a good question, where is he? He probably ran away after my first failed attempt. Can you actually see where he is? I can hear him. There he is, the little swine. Okay. Let's get back to here. Right, I have a funny feeling this is going to take a while, so I'm going to cut to music. Now you see we got the little person, but that's the two eggs, so now we've completed the level. So I'm just going to head back to the end portal and off we go. Run this bit for eight. I can if I don't fall off the edge. Okay, fly my Spyro, fly! Up and down, up and down, up and down. Right, sparks didn't hurt so I ain't got to eat anything. Okay, here we go to the return home portal. Okay, right. Well, as you see, I got all the gems for this level uh, and all the eggs. So that leaves one more place, I believe, which would be yes, the boss. So I will leave you all here. Head down to the boss and save. Okay, see you next episode. Bye.